I look around and I think about first responders that were policemen and firemen and emergency medical technicians in in the then 11 incorporated towns on the Gulf Coast and, and the three counties. But I also remember the people that came in from the rest of Mississippi. 19 search and rescue teams came in from around the state that Robert Latham had put together. Thank you all. Governor Laura and I are thrilled to be here. I'm glad Marty Stewart's on the stage. As the governor said, he and I had the most hair combined of all the state of Mississippi. Last time I was here, it didn't look quite this pretty. The place was just totally devastated. And then to see all the boats and cranes uh, is a testimony to the recovery of the Gulf Coast. You know, when I, when I think about uh, Katrina, I, of course, think about the lives lost, 238 here in Mississippi, and I know you'll join me uh, over the time to pray for the loved ones who still mourn the lives lost. It's important, however, not that they stay stuck in the past. It's important to realize how positive the future can be. The thousands who rushed into harm's way, many of whom are in this audience. America and the people of Mississippi owe you a huge great debt of gratitude. The 10th anniversary is a good time to honor courage and resolve. It's also a good time to remember how blessed we are to live in such a compassionate nation. I don't know if you remember, but there were church groups all around the state of Mississippi and all around the nation who came down to here to help feed the hungry and house those who lost them. 